Dear Morgan, I can't believe this day has finally come. From our first day down at the tennis courts, I knew deep down that we were going to spend forever together. Every day I'm amazed at your beauty, your strength, your love, and your pureness. You make me a better person every day. I am so excited to be your husband and for the amazing adventure we will have together. I love you so dearly and I can't wait to call you my wife. With all my heart forever, love, Ken. <laughs> oh. Oh my. <laughs> oh, you're beautiful. <laughs> Ken, I can't believe I get to marry the man of my dreams today. I am remembering our first Olive Garden and mini golf date over seven years ago. Our conversations flowed effortlessly and you made me laugh and smile constantly. Today, this all remains the same. You are truly my better half, encouraging to be my best self and supporting me along the way. I can't believe I'm so blessed to marry a humble leader that I know will one day be the best father to our children. It's going to be so fun seeing our lives transform in the years to come. And I can't wait to spend it all with you. I love you and adore you, Ken. Love, Morgan, forever. The covenant of marriage is the single most important human bond that holds all of God's work on the planet together. May your marriage bring you all the fulfillment a marriage should bring. And may the Lord give you patience, tolerance, and understanding. Remember that every burden is easier to carry when you have the shoulders of two instead of just one. May you remember that each time you speak to one another, you're talking to someone that God claimed and told, you are very special. As a representative of Jesus Christ, Almighty God, and in the name of the Father, and your Son, Jesus, and by the power of the Holy Spirit of God, I now pronounce you one together. You are now husband and wife. And Ken, you may now kiss your bride. <laughs> my happy privilege and honor to present to you for the first time, Ken and Morgan Smith. recently that God places friends in your life for a season and he places friends in your life for a lifetime and I know that Morgan and Ken are lifetime friends um, they have a very selfless love for each other and they have a very selfless love for their friends and I'm thankful to have you guys in my life as my friends and I love you and I know you're gonna have a long and wonderful marriage and I'm happy to be a part of it I told Susan I didn't really want to toss out a, a lot of cliches, you know, like we didn't lose a daughter, we gained a son type stuff, you know. But really what I'm, I'm going to say is, I mean this in all sincerity, is that we gained a family. Ken, I have to say how blessed you are. You leave today with a wife who's happy and warm and loved, loving and caring. And Morgan equally, equally blessed. You leave here today with a lovely dress, flowers, and free personal training for the rest of your life. <laughs> Inspired people know what they want, they have a vision for what they want, and they allow that vision to carry them forward. If you look at that couple right there, that's an inspired couple. That, that couple, I can tell you right now, is going to have a wonderful marriage because both of those people have a vision for their lives. They understand what it means to love one another. They understand what it means to sacrifice for one another. They understand what it means to sacrifice to reach goals, and now they get to do it together, hand in hand. So thank you for letting us celebrate with you tonight. We're happy to be here. It's an honor to stand by your side. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.